Hi guys, are you wondering what I'm doing from a square window? Look closer. Closer, you will see squares. But are these squares? Are these not what we know as squares? They are all squares. While these are square shapes, these squares are numbers. In this lesson, we will be looking at the squares of numbers. The square of a number is the product of a number and itself. This means that to get the square of a number, you multiply the number by itself. The square of the number is represented with a small number 2 on the top of the number. So, 1 squared is 1 times 1 equal to 1. 2 squared is 2 times 2 equal to 4. 3 squared is 3 times 3 equal to 9. Can you tell me what 4 squared is? It is 4 times 4 equal to 16. The square of a whole number is called a perfect square. So, 1, 4, 9, and 16 are all perfect squares. So, what is the relationship between this and this? We know that both are called squares, but what may be the relationship between them? It is because the square of a whole number can be arranged to fill up a square. We have 3 squared, which is 9. 9 items, say cookies, can be arranged to fill up a square. Let's try 5 squared. 5 squared is 25. 25 cookies can be arranged to fill up a square. Can 12 cookies be arranged to fill up a square? Let's try arranging it. No, it will not form a perfect square. Let's try another way. It still does not form a perfect square. So 12 is not a perfect square. Hence, the name for perfect squares come from their ability to be arranged to fill up a square. So in this lesson, we have seen that the square of a number is the product of the number multiplying itself. Love learning.